Hey there, Trudy here from It's a True Story. And today, well today, took a little summer break and I'm back with something amazing. I am having a reunion of sorts with some good friends of mine, with Faith and Jamalia and Shelly and Christine. And those are my friends from FB, where you probably know them from there and me from there. So we just wanted to get together, catch up, spill a little tea, talk about what it means to be a mom, talk about all the things that we're standing up for and against, and it's a really great high quality conversation with some really great high quality people. And the audio, the video, maybe a little bit not as high quality. So I apologize for that in advance. I did the best I could with what I have, which is a very rudimentary understanding of lighting, um, how the internet works, and all sorts of things that would make amazing audio video. Now, is it worth sitting through? I believe so. And you be the judge. Hello. Hello, Hi. and today, Hi. yes, you're seeing a cast of fabulousness that you don't <laughs> normally see on It's the True Story, which is my YouTube channel. Um, but I'm here with some I've friends. been there before. I've Chris been on your channel there. before. Yeah, we've had some friends here before, but not like this. No, so, not, not like, like this. this. Not like this. So today it's a reunion of shorts. I have, you know, uh, my friends from FBE, who we met at FBE, who are, none of us are, are with the channel anymore, but for real, we're friends. Yeah. Early in the pandemic, we had a little wind down moment. and came <laughs> up with this idea that it would be good to get the wall of moms back together again, get the band back together. Um, we got, we got Shelly, we got Faith, we got Jay, we got Chris, and we got me, Trudy. I thought it would be a great idea to catch people up what happened, where we've been. Um, you know, I was, I started with FB on Adults React five years ago, like literally mm -hmm. five years ago this summer. And it brought so many great things, like these ladies, especially, um, among other things. Um, and then it didn't. And then it brought uh, just a situation that, you know, with uh, racism and sexism and stuff that just weren't aligned with my core values. And so, you know, that's one of the beauty, beautiful things about React, right? They ask you to speak your mind, and so that's what we always do. So yep. exciting yep. to still be speaking my mind. <laughs> exciting to hear these ladies speak their mind. So that's what we're here for to do today. So are we all doing? part of the OG cast? Did we all start five years ago? Yeah. Uh, Shelly, when did you I start? I was slightly after that, though. Well, yeah. Well, uh, we no, it was probably 2015, 2016. Yeah. yeah I keep getting all like the memories like on Instagram and Snapchat yeah. and it was all this stuff coming up and I'm like the yeah. first time I filmed was on Father's Day five years ago. Wow. Oh wow. So that just like it just happened. Wow. Wow. You know, so, it takes a minute for them to air it. That was the first time the first time I filmed. It's were like, you should do this. You should you should get into this. So I did. And yeah. then and then, you know, in the same vein, it just it turned into something I couldn't support. It's yeah. just not who I was raised to be, who I raised my kids to be, who I raise all the extra kids I have to be. Um, right. You know, yep. and I get, okay, we apologize for that, but that's that's mm -hmm. not good enough for me. I started from the jump, excited, happy. Um, yeah, Jay was one of the OGs. I was the OG, so mm -hmm. I was like starting from the beginning, the first adult one, feeling excited, happy. Um, I remember getting the contract and they're like, people will recognize you in the streets. And I'm like, <laughs> don't try I'm to like, play no, me. They Ain't won't. nobody yeah. gonna recognize me on your show. <laughs> and actually people really was like, you, yeah. you're Jack, you're Jamela, you're a mama yeah. from an adult. And I'm like, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. really? So I know, I still trip that. up today, it's so cool. Yeah. 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 Uh, How about I, you, Faith? So I started after the trademark thing. It was May after the trademark thing. I was interviewing right before the trademark situation happened. And so once that cleared up, I think it was like a two or three month thing. I think I actually started on May, May 2nd. I think that was my first one. I think it was the Prince episode. Mm. I think that oh, I'm so jealous. I wanted to be in that. Damn yeah. It. <laughs> um, yeah, and I just I just had a I, all the way up until I've actually had a really really good time and yeah. um, had fun going into the office. I always you know just kind of um, it was it was 
it wasn't necessarily a highlight, but it was definitely a change of pace for me and was enjoyable. And like Shelly, um, my, my kid, Asia, she helped me fill out. She filled out the application for me. Um, I, I had no idea what it was before I started and I really didn't have um, a connection to what, you know, FBE was. I just know that it was in front of the camera. It was my opinion and that, um, that it, it's, it seemed like a lot of fun. I think the beautiful thing was, is that for me, when my friend's kids recognize me, like, is that Auntie yes. Jay? Right. On React? And I'm like, what the hell? This shit is really serious. Yeah. <laughs> I, I want to make a point about being recognized. Um, I never was re recognized until later on, maybe in the last, I would say, year, maybe year mm -hmm. and a half. Mm -hmm. when Whenever we went to the fan thing, um, yeah. you know, they are recognized. But I was, I was actually very grateful, thankful that um, that I didn't get a lot of a lot of that. And I don't know if it's because uh, you know I changed a lot from the beginning to now. Like just mm -hmm. my look yeah. changed. Not for sure about that, or mm -hmm. um, I don't know what it was. But I just never. And it could be also. I'm a very you know, you, sometimes, you know, on camera, you can be, you know, you, your personality and who you are. Yeah. Like, I absolutely who I am, that, what you see mm -hmm. on camera, out a lot with a lot of people. Like, Jay knows, like, I, you know, Trudy, you know, like, I don't go out with nope. a, lot, a lot of people. I just don't, you know what I mean? Yeah. You know what I mean? So I'm very private in that sense yeah. of the, you know, in mm -hmm. that sense. So I don't know what it was, but... I just thought everybody was talking about that though. Everybody was like, do, 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 do recognize it and this and this. I was like, oh, I'm doing well. Yeah, <laughs> right? Know. On that note, I mean, this is so, I mean, we're making an assumption that everyone knows what happened. Basically what happened is that we're on this YouTube channel. It has 21 million subscribers. We're known as the moms. We're the parents. We're this and that. We're outspoken. We're all of us usually speak up for like, what we think is the right thing, what we think is going to be best for kids, because we all have right. kids, and that's what we think about, right? Yeah. We come from yeah. being a mom. Yeah. We come from being a mom, and so what happened was that there was, you know, the big thing that happened was there was a Black Lives Matter video, which I think both Jay and Faith were in, right? And um, and, a, and one of our castmates, Kennedy, young girl, and she, the biggest thing for me, and I think I'm going to guess you guys agree, was that after she filmed that video, she appealed to the company and said, look, I've had some problems in the past. I had a stalker. It was, shit was real. And right. what are you going to do to protect me? And she heard right. crickets. Thank you. Yeah. And nothing. And in the midst of, I mean, all of this. And then more things came to light about a history of blackface, um, other inappropriate things. Right. Like so much yeah. came out that I know, you know, me personally, like they paid me money to share my opinions which were right. normally yes. this opinion like right. that ain't okay and i'm not staying so right. i know for me the tipping point honestly you know kennedy's like nice lady i maybe sat with you in the waiting room once or twice she doesn't really know me i don't really know her but yeah. i know her she's my son's age all the moms were together because they did gravitate and they we just can't help but treat them like our yep. kids, like our family, I think that's why it hit so hard because I did consider us all a family. That's how I would always address, you know, our group chats, you know, my FBA yep. family. Like, I truly felt that, at least for me, and I felt like they, they encouraged that type of feeling between the reactors. Like, there was something about the moms, like uh, any age group could gravitate towards the moms because we just... We just envelop them because that's who we are and that's what we do. Like I did one video with Kennedy, but before that, I didn't really know her. Mom. I still felt some kind of way, just like I did about all the kids. <laughs> it, it felt like personal. It felt personal. Yeah. Yep. Like how could you do that to a member of, of our family? I agree. Yeah. That's, that's not right. okay. So yeah. my thing is, I'm gonna be real. I never work with Kennedy. But my whole issue was, like you said, me and Faith was part of the Black Lives Matter episode. My whole thing is, for you not to protect this child, yeah. this is a child to me. And right. I'm known as a mom, 
as right. adult we act, it was a wrap. Mm -hmm. As soon as I got word at 12 p.m. and we, you know, I'm talking to people, I'm like, what the heck is going on? Yeah. By seven, eight, nine p.m., I just still didn't get the response for the founder mm -hmm. or anything that was appropriate to make me feel comfortable or yeah. for my little young mama to feel comfortable. It was a wrap. But it, even, though, even though it 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 hit social media on Wednesday, it was after um, Kennedy had posted her statement and and yeah. so forth. She had reached out to them the day before or two days before um, that Tuesday to, to get a response. I think one of the things that, that a lot of people don't realize is that when she was asking, um, she was asking for all of us who did that filming for Black Lives Matter, the, for the um, Black Lives Matter video, if we all to be protected. That baby went in not for her oh, help. Right. She no. trying to get her for all wow. of us. And wow. so the fact of the wow. matter is she had been through what she had been through before. And so mm -hmm. she was following up to say, how are you gonna protect us all? So she didn't even go in there. It wasn't even about necessarily just protect her. Sometimes I feel like people will talk at the Black Lives Matter thing, the whole situation. Like we are actually people, we're not objects. You're, right. you're, you know, you talk at the Black Lives Matter, like this is some poster kind of thing that you're looking at. And I'm actually a person. Right. Jay is actually right. a person. We were all, we did that video. And when I found this out, I felt like I got kicked in the teeth. I got, I felt like I got punched in the gut. I felt used. And it, yeah. and it wasn't because more than anything then, okay, Kennedy is experiencing, I'm finding this out. Okay, the black face. This is the thing. The black face alone should be enough for, for, in my opinion, any person to be like, I'm done in general. Just exactly. that alone. However, you had an opportunity for all this time to set it right, and you did. Yeah. And don't get me wrong. It is not, you know, there's so many people that make up, you know, FBE, the staff behind, because, you know, I'm sure we'll talk about that a little bit long, you know, more like the, the people that were hired and that left before, the staff, the different things. But it all starts from the top. I, I can't, I can't, I can't express that enough. When they came at me with the Black Lives Matters um, episode, I was honored that the fact they asked me. Right. And I was grateful. I felt love. I was like, I'm about to tell yeah. my son's story. I'm about to tell a legacy, the shit that I went through. My son, her, do you know how many comments I got after that? That they were like, dang, your son got to make a copy of his license plate and yeah. insurance? Yeah. For the simple fact, and just like, it just hurts my feelings. Like, I wanted to tell my story. That's I cannot what I believe felt. I felt company. like adult black mom. Right. That's yeah. how I felt. When I had I'm people the, like, dang, you're my mom. You're this. Yep. Mom. Yep. I'm gonna Mom, I wish you my mom. That was yep. my feeling, and I was so happy for it. That switch off of the honor of actually being asked to be doing the video was awesome. Yes. Back in the days, like who doesn't exactly. do? That? Yeah. Explain yourself. How yep. many times have we had to? Ex Don't get me wrong. People do stuff in the past. Yeah, people yep. do things in the past, and I'm not even knocking you for that, but yep. acknowledge it. I'm like, if they would have just come when, to us, like actual family, because who hasn't fucked up? Who hasn't right. fucked up? Real talk. Uh, when, man, real talk, when come and say, look. Out, yeah, when little mama came out about her situation, it took what, Faith? Eight, nine hours? Can't Boys even family. her? They sent an email at 10 p.m. Uh, 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 10 p.m. that day, they, and before they, they came even, out at 12. If they actually posted something, I think it, they posted something on social media first and then sent the email. They didn't even send a pre-email to us first on that one. Yeah. Simple fact that you didn't respond, okay. and we all sitting there yeah. in a the group. It just hit me really hard that um, 
well, God, my children would have been pissed if I stayed. But it, by the same token, there was just no way. I just, I couldn't live. And it was really their, their reaction to the whole thing, not to say react, but <laughs> it's one thing to do that stuff, right? It's one thing to misbehave or to have faulted or whatever, to make the mistake. Um, I'm not that rigid, but at the same time, they just didn't respond. And then when they did respond, it was garbage. And it was, you know, stuff somebody in our group would find out sort of on the side. It wasn't like public or whatever they did publicly was stupid. Or we'd get emails at midnight that were, right. you know, I'd wake yeah. up the next day and be like, uh -huh. what the fuck is this? But yeah, I mean, like, it just wasn't right. It just wasn't right. And I couldn't do it. And part of what I love about this is the outreach that kids from around the world exactly have done yep. to me, have like reached out and you know, DMs and everything else. And yes. like, I can't yes. support that. Like, I want to support those kids. I don't want to support this. This is not how I want them to behave or me. Because we live, we literally are, are the moms. They give us like their moms. Like their yeah. moms. Yeah. We, we, moms. Can't, we can't stand for any of no. this. You're the host and you know this yes. whole thing here and all of us talking about this. How do you feel, Trudy? Like, honestly, like okay. I know yeah, we talk, but how do you feel? Let the, like, everybody know. It's like, what's going on? Yeah, yeah this so, is your table, girl. <laughs> oh, right, my table. I mean, how do I feel? Nauseous, disgusted, sick. And I will tell you, you know, when all this broke, so we're talking about this 10 o'clock at night, it's like, I'm just logging on and I'm seeing all this stuff and I'm seeing all my friends quit. Rapid succession, you know, Jay, yeah and Faith and Sergio and yeah. it goes on. Uh -huh. And I'm like, what the hell happened? And you know, the next morning I wake up and I'm like, I'm gonna make a case cause I got that privilege and I'm gonna go make it work for me. And I write a letter, a long letter, <laughs> crickets, no response. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, okay, interesting. And then more things are coming out on social media. And I reach out to Faith cause she's my friend. And we have a conversation and I'm like, I'm just like, I'm still holding on to an idea that I can talk some sense into somebody somewhere. Oh, I know. And that's Faith's the mom in us. That's yes. literally the mom in us. Yeah. Right. That's yeah. the mom. Like, like, surely I'm going to talk to them, just... they'll understand, right? Exactly. Yeah. Trudy. Yes. Yeah. Trudy. Got it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So oh, when I talked to Faith, she said something to me that, that was life changing. Really. I mean, I said, you know, maybe I could just like, maybe they just need a little guidance. I can hold their hand and make them up. Faith said, Trudy, I am not holding the hands of a grown ass man. That's a grown ass people. That's not how it works. Facts. You want to make some change, yeah. you make some change. You make, you, you make it. You, you make some change, you walk away. And you I thought, and I still sat for a minute and thought, how is this how am i going to do this because it's not fucking about me yeah. and, and i don't want yeah. to feel performative but i already right. know what my i know where i'm at at this <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not holding i'm not i'm not grown-ass man's mommy you know right. but i am a person that you know like i know the world i want to live in and i want my kids to live in it ain't this Back. boom i'm done that's it yeah. and it wasn't about I, it wasn't about like teaching a lesson or anything like that because I'm not here to right. teach anybody. Right. But it we are parents. We are moms. We take care of kids. Yeah. We do a lot. Yeah. And we're trying to make a stand for you guys. And what we did when we left was for a reason. Right. My kids will never look at me and clown me and be like, Mom, you sell out. Hell exactly. No. Yeah. Yeah. What I love the fact that Trudy and Shelly how they business and it wasn't a fact it's and they game, did it game. like that it wasn't game game like you gotta roll with us or right yeah. you guys did that was right us being you know part of this black life matter situation yes yeah. how we felt because that is that has to be in the forefront but the tangible of how white privilege or people, non-people of color can actually help, yeah. I think we yeah. need allies for sure. What what you stand for, what's what's the right thing to do? Like Jay, you had said something earlier about, you know, I have a whole thing on 
my idea of what protesting is and what that is. I mean, honestly, beside our, my people have marched a hell of a lot for a, a long hell of a time. And Here. so for me, Here. so for me, I had to, I, I, there was something else different that I wanted to do or to be a part of. So I was looking and had my ears open to what I could be a part of this movement about. Mm -hmm. So this coming up was my protest. It was my movie, it being Fact. on the right side. Fact. <laughs> we spilled a little tea in this episode. I think we dug it up. But I'm here's the point. point. Here's your takeaway. Don't mess with the wall of moms. You don't fuck no. with us. You just don't. Whether you're an ally, like Shelly and me, whether you're on the front lines, like my friends, my my Faith, my Jay, my Chris, you know what? You gotta, you gotta come from a place of heart and take a freaking stand. And yeah. you know what? And then it's not, then it's not performative, then it's not bullshit, then it's you. Right. If you're a YouTube personality or you're a person who has some notoriety or whatever, like, you know what? That's when you use your power. That's yeah. my opinion. That's, That's my opinion. Right. I want to thank everybody who's here right now because we are really family and we are really friends. And we yeah, are really, thank you we, for are, we, are, we are women who stand together yes. 150,000%. And when, right. one of our, when, our, when somebody threatens one of our babies, they threaten all of our babies, period. That's and it's right. all of our babies. Yeah, and not even that. If you guys have a subjection or yeah. even yes. a comment, yeah. that you want us to do, put it in the comments. And all all my friends here, I'm gonna have links to all their social media and YouTube channels and Instagram and all sorts of places you can find them and keep following them. I'm also gonna include Kennedy's information because that's what we we're that's talking right. about. So if you haven't had a chance to watch her videos on YouTube, if you don't follow her on Instagram, give you some insight into what we, all, we were talking about if you're not totally clear. Yeah. No. All right, so I know that was a little bit of an abrupt ending, but like I said, I cannot vouch for the quality of the audio and the video today, but I can vouch for the fact that I really appreciate your watching, that I really appreciate my friends joining me in conversation, and that I really hope you'll see you again soon. So you know what? Like, subscribe, and come on back, because I got more stuff coming for you in the fall. Bye.